Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to another intraday video day. Guys, this time around, we, uh, we would like to show the relationship between how important the oil is to the rest of the market. This is the chart of oil in the daily basis. Everyone thought, including me, that when this decline, this sharp decline happened around the May or the May of May, we believe that the top was in place and then the oil is gonna go down to around around the thirty dollars a barrel. Now from here, this is on the daily, we can see a three and a like a flat way right here when you got A, B and C and oil. Now, right here we can call one, two, one, two, three, four, five, four and a five. And it looks like that oil is gonna start trading high. Now, how does that gonna affect the whole market? I can tell you right now, it looks like that if oil goes higher, all the risk trade is gonna go higher and then oil is gonna I mean and then oil is gonna go to around I would say 120 being this around 114 around 120 125 before a decline now what I'm gonna show to you guys now is so you guys understand how important is the correlation between this pair even though many people don't believe that I'm gonna show you now I'm gonna show you the oil is going to be the red one the euro dollar is going to be green the dollar index is going to be black and the s p is going to be blue now let me show you now how the dollar index react together with oil and you guys gonna understand why i cannot be a bullish dollar Let's, let me let me put down the dollar index. Look, it's an inverse. If you look at it, the black one is the dollar index. Oil is the is the red. So look at the days, guys. A low right here, a high right here, a high right here, a low right here. Same day that oil peak or top, the dollar index battle. Same day here, same day there. Now. I can count five ways almost completed right here in oil, which made the case that the dollar is about to turn higher before the dollar, before an oil stone lower, before the oil kick higher and the dollar kick lower. You see how, how, how they relate, right? Look, any day that you see a higher low than oil, you're gonna see a high or low in the index. Look, it's almost perfect. It's almost perfect. Now, let me take the dollar so you guys do not get confused with that many lines. And let me show you now the euro. And look at this. High euro, high oil. Lower oil, lower euro. And the same, and the same. Now, the whole point also is that this is corrective or at least is a nest or corrective with the divergency that we have in the four hour chart which i'm going to show you later you guys can get the conclusion that this is an avc right here which make the euro triangle case to be very well defined when euro is gonna bust high all right now let's take the euro out of Let's take the euro and let's add the S&P. Look, same scenario. A lower low, a high right here. They differ a little bit right here. You see, it's like one if over the other one. Now, we all know that the S&P is doing a triangle. We all know that the S&P is doing a classic triangle here. The charge that delayed it, that's why you don't see it real time. But the S&P is doing a triangle, which is gonna trade here, it's already there, and then it's gonna go this. So what oil is gonna do, higher. What the euro is gonna do, higher. 
what the odd dollar index gonna do low now finally let me show you also I show you the dollar already I show you the euro the S&P so I show you the four pairs that I want to I want to show you guys there so if you put all together this is what you're gonna get look easy to see let me, let me read all this these are daily charts guys easy to see that the trend of the blue the trend of the blue the red and the green is to the upside and they are correlated here and the trend in the black which is the dollar index is going down inverse to this so if you have a clear triangle in the S&P a clear triangle in the euro a clear triangle in the oil what the dollar index is gonna go the dollar index at the end of the day is gonna go this way and all these three they're gonna trade Okay guys, I, I hope you guys understand that pretty well and I'll get back to you guys later.